50, welcome back. There's a new football team in town, and this team is full of strong and determined women who want to prove that football isn't just for men. ABC 7's Iris Lopez introduces us to El Paso's all-women tackle football team, the Sun City Stealth. It's today's Sunday Fun Day Moment, sponsored by Sarah Farms. So if your dream is to play the game, you know, the men aren't the only one that get to play it. You know, now women get to play it. Doug Upshaw is the head coach for El Paso's all-women tackle football team, the Sun City Stealth. For Coach Upshaw, bringing this unique team to the borderland is a way to open the door for women in sports. You see the trend now, like the NFL has female officials, uh, the NFL has, you know, women on the coaching staff. It's starting to get popular with, with women, and but there's not a lot of opportunities out there. So we wanted to give the opportunity for women to play football. You know, when I first thought about it, I was like, oh no, tackle football girly you know I don't know but after going out to practice and giving it a try and everything fell in love with it and it I've had a blast ever since wide receiver Stephanie Aragon is one of over 40 women who are proud to prove that football isn't just a man sport women endorse so much more than men and they're incredible out there if you go out to our practice to our game you're gonna see they even probably hit even harder because they have more to prove Sun City Stealth is affiliated in the Women's Football Alliance all players are paid to play during the regular season. The team will play a total of six regular season games with hopes of bringing home a WFA Division Championship title. For 34, linebacker, Cynthia Cervantes. Bringing women's tackle football to the borderland is about more than just proving that women can play the sport. It's about showing the younger generation that anything is possible. Because now little girls around in the community can see, you know what, I play maybe football in a co-ed team when I'm younger, but now I can go up and play when I'm older and, and play a sport that I love. And I'm not going to be afraid to be like, you know what, I'm a girl, who cares? I'm going to go out there and, and show what I got. Iris Lopez, ABC7. That looks so fun. Yeah, it really does. Well, the team will be playing two home games this month. If you'd like more information on how you can purchase tickets for the games, just click on this story at kvia.com.